Blake Stogner is back from his time with the Peace Corps. I served in Vanuatu. It's a country just west of Fiji, east of the Australian coast. It's uh, an archipelago of islands, so it's a conglomeration of about 80-some-odd islands. Stogner admits there's a lot of planning that goes into picking the right place. I was timid about speaking another language, and English was uh, predominantly an official language within the South Pacific, so it would have made it an easier transition for me to go into another country and, and begin speaking their language while the host country nationals had at least a little bit of background knowledge of my own language. Peace Corps volunteers are assigned in 76 countries, providing technical assistance in six program areas, including education, health, business, and information and communications. Um, for me, it was just really profound because I got to, you know, get into this community, didn't know the language, didn't know the culture that well. Um, so for me, it was just take that away, how to really integrate into a community that you know nothing about. Um, and I, from that, now I know what I want to do in the future. February 26th through March 3rd is Peace Corps Week, an opportunity for volunteers to share their experiences with those interested in participating in the program. You can talk to a recruiter, but the recruiter is there to recruit you. You know, they, they want people to join the Peace Corps. And I think talking to just a regular return Peace Corps volunteer um, gives you a very realistic perspective of what it could be like. Local volunteers returning from their trips are speaking to community members as well as students at New Mexico State University and sharing their experiences about being overseas. For KRWG, I'm Carlos Correa.